Hello, you all. You already know what we about to get into. We finna get into this, into these messages, and see what our Elohim would like us to know at this time. The song that keep replaying in my mind is that um, Megan The Stallion, Tina Montana. Okay, now the part that keep playing is, I'm looking for you, bitch. Lay low. And the other part is, this could be like your energy, or this could even be this, this same person energy. The other part to keep playing is, um, hold pretty please, I wish you would come say something to me. I've been itching to go the fuck off. Okay? So... Somebody looking for somebody. And then just just by the just by the name of the song with the Tina Montana, because you know, like it remind me of Hannah Montana and she like like this person is like giving the energy that this person what they need to be really looking for instead of looking for somebody else. <laughs> they need to look for themselves because this person don't even want to be they self, but they looking for <laughs> This hoe want to be somebody else, but she looking for somebody, though, okay? So, lay low. I, I see the five of cups in the depth. This person could want to end you or whatever the case may be. This person trying to cause some sort of tower. We got the, the tower to the death. So, this person could be trying to end you or... Could have made some offers against you to in you or whatever the case may be, and you keep escaping it. So maybe this person wanna try to get you in the physical, but let's see what's going on. What do we need to know about this? I kept seeing the eight of swords too. This person is psychotic. Ace of Cups in reverse, the devil in reverse. The hermit in reverse. <laughs> the four of cups at the top. You keep being a missed opportunity for this person to do something to. This person is unawakened. This person do over the top cruel spiritual shit. <laughs> this motherfucker looking for your ass. This person could be a Capricorn or Virgo, water sign. Buddy, they looking for you, a Leo. This person is passionate. They be doing some strong, cruel, spiritual shit. They be manifesting against you. They be even employing people to go against you. Like, it is horrible. This could be somebody from your childhood. This could be a family member or somebody else's. But this motherfucker crazy. <laughs> this motherfucker is crazy. They be doing the manifesting. They be employing people. This person even spend money to do some cruel ass shit to you. Like this person crazy. And don't want to be themselves. <laughs> That's the fuck they need to go find. I'm telling you, this person be riding around with cancer energy. Riding around looking for your ass. They looking for you, bitch. Lay low. Because they want to argue and fight. Five of wands. <laughs> this don't need to go look for they motherfuckers. <laughs> this ain't funny, but... <laughs> ah. Oh, shit. Honey, they be sending off that energy quick at your ass. That shit crazy. It could be a can. It's a Cancer, a Capricorn, a Virgo, a Leo. This could even be some of the signs that this person employed to go against you. Like it's crazy. I'm telling you, this a hater. Five of Swords. But all this person is doing is self sabotaging their own life. So let them. <laughs> Let they ass be crazy. 
This she crazy. This is a hater. This is purely out of hate. For some of y'all, one of these people can't even fight. One of these people got a lack of experience anyway. It's like, this shit is crazy. Somebody can even be two cars deep. <laughs> With the cherry. Oh, man. Somebody can even be two cars deep. Yeah, somebody. There's a magician. Could be a Cancer or an Aries. Did somebody have put their talents to service? With the name of Pentacles? It's going to be some type of truth or breakthrough or whatever this is. Somebody see the truth about somebody that they was helping, that they delusional. This person delusional and this high priestess delusional. <laughs> yeah, somebody... Uh traveled and was communicating with somebody and offered them some abundance to attack you look how that just lined up the three of wands the eight of wands the ace of pentacles the seven of wands came up with the right idea to move forward with attacking you maybe because of this abundance it could be a lot with this ace of pentacles but to attack you this shit crazy Yeah, for this hating ass bitch, the Empress to the Father. <laughs> some of these people could like try to attack with communication, but some could really be sending out some shit for this hating ass hoe. This person could be a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Libra, Sag, Cancer. Leo. <laughs> this shit is crazy, man. This whole crazy as fuck. But it's so crazy because this whole real one of these hoes got real bad anxiety. It's like, what is you even doing? <laughs> About this self sabotaging, hating ass hoe. The sun is shining on what this hoe been doing. It's like this bitch scared. One of these bitches scared as fuck. I mean, anxiety. Um, just scary. Like, what the fuck are you doing on the real? Yeah, this person was trying to act like an angel, temperance to the Queen of Pentacles. This bitch. <laughs> This bitch been employing people to sacrifice people and shit. <laughs> and acting goody two shoes. I'm telling you, just all for a new beginning, all for somebody else's energy. I'm telling you, putting their teachings to use. This person even got an emperor putting his teachings to use. A magician could be an Aries. An Aries or a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, but they sun sign could be an Aries with the Emperor to the Magician coming out. But this is like a hitman energy with the King of Swords. They even got this man putting his teachings to use on top of that too. <laughs> These people want to leave this person behind though and stop collaborating with this hoe. These people might end up separating from this person with the three of swords. Because this bitch is going to suffer trauma, heartbreak, and loss. Everything that you collaborate to do, bitch, it's going to hurt you. It ain't going to hurt this person that you keep trying to get everybody to attack, ho. It's going to hurt you, bitch. You're going to be the one suffering heartbreak and loss, and you're going to be tied up in the shit, too. Stupid ass, ho. <laughs> Because this person going to get justice on you. Your, your suffering will be this person justice. And you, this person could even have an illness too. Yeah, this person going to suffer heartbreak and loss for going against you with the Knight of Swords keep taking this action. For some of y'all, this person might get caught up in a court of law depending on what they're doing because it looked like physical things and spiritual things. 
<laughs> this a wicked weird bitch. This person passion been growing growing while waiting to uh communicate with you, waiting to talk to you. This person been trying to cause you some ongoing battles, boy. This shit crazy, but this person gonna you keep escaping them though. You keep escaping them, you keep walking away. You ain't for the shit. So this person gonna be, this person gonna be, cause this person keep trying to trap you with some sort of illness, with embarrassment, with heartbreak. No. This hoe gonna be trapped up and tied up in it. This hoe might even go to jail. This this person might really face some type of crazy ass embarrassment, but this person gonna be hurt, down bad, and motherfucking ill. <laughs> Confirmation, because I'm telling you, this is a sick hoe. <laughs> this is this is a sick hoe. Like, learn to leave people alone. This could be somebody who like to wear heels and different wigs or different looks or whatever the case may be. This person, this person, um, or this person just want to be like somebody else. It's weird. And look, bottom of the deck. Black magic indicated. Y'all, this motherfucker doing black magic then be trying to run. Bitch, please. <laughs> you ain't gonna be able to run from that shit. That black magic chasing you. Yeah, this I told this this whole sick, this whole caught a case, this caught this whole caught a STD or a STI. And now this bitch watching angrily in the background. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. I'm telling you. And it could be something that they have to work on daily with their health and shit. Something is a routine that they got to take care of. This person is still in their south node, though. They refuse to learn life lessons. Lessons still not learned. This person feel like they got some unfinished business with you, but you're uninterested. You don't want no type of offers from anybody. <laughs> but this person trying to force their motherfucking way. And this person be trying to cock block you. What did I say? <laughs> <laughs> the fact that this shit turned over you be trying to dust this impersonate and bitch off and this hoe be trying to cock block this hoe is getting karma this person wants you to this person wanted you to somehow get their karma no they're gonna get their karma this person refused to heal this a fake ass friend to try to act like they a, a, a friend in the upright you don't want no drama and this person refused to fucking heal. So it's just like, please. <laughs> this whole getting karma. This whole is a fake friend or they like got some fake ass friends. You ain't trying to share karma with this person. This person up in their head about some sort of communication. So this person been waiting to smile up in your face. You could be in your North Node, having fulfillment in your life purpose. This person just want to fake smile in your face. This person guilty of fucking you over with no shame. <laughs> or this person could be fake smiling in the man face. Guilty, man abuse, player, always partying and shit, doing spells. This somebody. This is somebody that's two-faced as fuck trying to cause delays in your life and shit like this is crazy i just seen the law too this person is stalking watching and obsessed trying to pull some type of scarcity tactics this person be looking you up researching you studying you creating fake accounts Something might happen here dealing with the law here. I'm telling you, this person might end up getting caught up with the law. They could even try to get you caught up with the law with some type of legal issues, but it keep getting rejected. This person could even try to give money for, you know, for people to do shit to you, but it keep getting rejected. Something is clearing up fast for you, though. This is a woman scorn. This woman scorn could have Libra in the 10th house, Libra in Uranus. 
They can have Libra somewhere in their chart. They could even be a Libra. Or they want something to balance out. Like they want your notoriety, your power, whatever the case may be. They think this is so genius. Your shine irritate this person demons, honey. This is some sort of love triangle shit. Somebody mentally ill. Or they got Libra somewhere in their chart. There could also be an Aquarius too. This Aquarius do shit with a dirty hand. They show fake gratitude and shit. There's a Libra involved. There's an Aries involved. They sticking out. There's a Cancer involved as well. So this could be this person or they fake ass friend. There is an Aquarius, Libra, Aries, and Cancer involved. You could be being chased down by these drunk ass bitches with unhealthy habits. <laughs> yeah, because of these skeletons here. Oh, shit. Yeah, these some karmic feminines. These ain't no divine feminines. They be trying to impersonate like they divine feminines, but they karmic. These people got lustful, animalistic, sexual desires. These hoes could have a lot of options. These hoes could be going through some family issues. Somebody going to be coming into some money or some type of fulfillment, though. Some growth, some happiness. Some inheritance. This could be about your inheritance. Because whoever you are, you're not clout hungry. You're just worried about your fulfillment, your inheritance, what you winning, your jackpot, your whatever. You can have Jupiter and Cancer, Aries, Libra, uh, Aquarius. Yeah, somebody could be holding a grudge against you, just watching you holding a fucking grudge. This person, this person could want to try to travel towards you and physically abuse you. Please keep your distance, fuck boy, fuck girl alert. This person just want to physically abuse you. This person got a low IQ. And this person be on the same shit different day. Mm -mm. Yeah, this person think they be moving in silence, but... There's something here about... um. This person could be envious. This person could be a good parent or this person trying to keep silent something about something with some kids or this neglect to be going on. This person is envious here. This person could have tried to be the other woman. This person is of darkness. This this is somebody who stopped taking birth control to get pregnant on purpose and shit. This person is of the darkness. This person ain't sorry for nothing they did either. Sorry, not Sorry. But the thing is, you not in no type of third party or entanglement. Whoever they dealing with never satisfied, always looking for stand-ins, or this is this person. But you're not a part of no third party or no entanglement. Your emotions is intact. And you don't drink, you don't abuse alcohol or drown in your sorrows, and you ain't no crazy bitch. That all came out in reverse. But somebody is getting some sort of evidence, screenshots, or whatever. This is this happiness hater who wanted somebody to stop dealing with you, deal with them. This person be leaving comments up under your uh platforms and shit. This is somebody who had a miscarriage. They love to talk shit. Just fucking weird. Miscarriage or an abortion. Could have did both. Just raggedy. Something gonna happen with this person's car. This person got karmic friends, or they is a karmic friend. Secret competition, can't fully trust them. This person's head is all in the clouds. This person need to be seeking therapy. This person don't like, this person don't have sex with the same sex for money. But there is child neglect here. Or this person could have been neglected as a kid, and that's why. So this person about to have to pay their dues. This person about to go through something where it's going to be some type of wake-up call. This person might end up getting stripped down, too, because they're going to have to face the truth. This, somebody could be a Capricorn or have Capricorn in their chart somewhere. This person act try to act like they unbothered, but they're very bothered. Whoever this person is that they've been having, been having dealing dick to them, this person might not end up going to jail. Or somebody could have got out. 
Somebody got Leo and Venus. Somebody was having sex raw with a Leo and Venus or a Leo. Obsessive, dangerous, toxic, unhealthy, karmic, possessive. This person be on the same shit different day. Possibly somebody with a Sagittarius moon, Gemini moon, Virgo moon, or a Pisces moon. Somebody want to kiss somebody ass. Because they never had no fucking facts. This person going through bad karma for trying to get vengeance on somebody. Could also be a man. Boss daddy. Now this person sitting up here curious about you in regret. This person had many faces of fuckery. Something is getting caught on camera here. Something about a dirty offer here. This shit is crazy. Somebody got caught cheating online. Yeah, somebody in some type of groupy ass energy. This man is confused. This man cold hearted though. Somebody might get a DUI, DWI, and it might affect their materials, their work, uh, you know, their luxury, their security. That's second house. This might get brought to some sort of attention to as well. It might mess with somebody's career, their power, their empire, 10th house. Yeah, somebody might get some sort of insight on something. Yeah, because somebody was being cold-hearted. Somebody shine, irritate somebody demons. Icebox where the heart used to be. And then we got uh, the nine of swords, this cold-hearted person. They might end up feeling something because their heart going to be broken. They're going to face embarrassment. They might even get sick, and they're going to be entrapped with it. Somebody definitely is going to jail, or they're going to be tied up and locked in spiritually with what they put out and or physically. This is crazy. This could even This is multiple people, too. Just weird. Whoever you are that these individuals is doing this to, you could be any sign. Because on the real, you ain't even come out here. As, <laughs> you ain't out here. So you ain't even, you ain't too much worried about it. Because <laughs> you ain't even out here. But honey, somebody want to attack you. Or multiple people want to attack you, whether it's spiritually or physically. This is wild. Right here. This is wild. This is wild. Superficial, crazy ass people. Nut job. <laughs> Figure it to you and literally. <laughs> Nut jobs. <laughs> I think that's what I'm going to call it. Nut jobs. Because <laughs> this is what the fuck this is. Yeah, it's change coming here. It's splitting the deck. <sighs> it's some sort of change. Yeah, it's some sort of change. Somebody might be coming into some unexpected income or some unexpected income might bring some sort of change or somebody is changing, giving somebody some sort of income here. Yeah, some type of change here. There could be something dealing with a child. I don't want to say a karmic child, but it's some type of change dealing with a child. This child is in reverse. That somebody could have been working or working for or giving money to here with the occupation. Yeah, somebody was stealing. Somebody could have been stealing from their job. Stealing money from somebody. Maybe somebody was lying and they really got a, had an abortion or got a miscarriage or something like that. Somebody was stealing. Somebody tried to steal something from somebody that's high honor. They going to jail. Imprisonment. Somebody going to jail. jail 
somebody also could have tried to entrap or lock somebody up that's uh you know of high honor but there's a main female that's going to jail you're going to jail in the distant horizons false person you're going to jail there could be two women going to jail main female again you're going to jail this could be somebody's family family room somebody family or somebody that somebody was dating and then we got in the community What's on y'all path is jail. You're going to jail. That's your gift. You're going to jail. And the community going to see it. We got expectations here. Yeah, that's what you both can expect here. Courthouse. Shit popping out twice for you hoes. Expectation, expectation, courthouse. Somebody might end up going to jail. These two women could be looking at their community to help them. Their eyes is on the community. There's a main male who might end up passing here, coughing in a distant horizon. Main male or mature female or both coughing. Or they're going to be facing some sort of ending in the courthouse. I'm telling you, ju judgment. Somebody judgment is woo. Somebody calling judgment on somebody. A mature man might get the message about some sort of sudden wealth here. And it's gonna leave this mature man in despair. Cause somebody getting some sort of sudden wealth. Somebody can see 7-Eleven. Yeah. It's gonna put somebody in despair because this privileged lady is gonna have some sort of great fortune. They an official person. Could be somebody lover or soulmate. But somebody decided to change lovers, put in toil and labor and work hard for their family or a family they created. Now they concern. Now they concern. Yeah, that somebody's high honor. Message of concern. There's a message of concern. Something about some sort of gift. Yeah, somebody is under judgment here. Mm, mm, mm. Yep, that could be the fortune, you know, what's on somebody's pathway. So, is there anything else we need to know about this situation before I wrap this thing up? Is there anything else we need to know about this situation? No. I'm going to pull a grateful heart message because it's always something to be grateful for. Walk like this, talk like this, bitch, you can never. So we have here... Let the words of my mouth and meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight, O Yahweh. I will praise Yahweh's name in song and glorify him with thanksgiving. In him our hearts trust. In him our hearts rejoice, for we trust in his holy name. May your unfailing love be with us, Yahweh, even as we put our hope in you. Your Yahweh will bless you in all your harvest, in all the work of your hands, and your joy will be complete. Shout for joy, you heavens. Yahweh's comfort, Yahweh comforts his people. May Yahweh give you the desire of your heart and make all your plans succeed. 
each day Yahweh pours his unfailing love upon me and through each night I sing his song. Those who look to him for help will be radiant with joy. You make me glad by your deeds, Yahweh. I sing for joy at what your hands have done. Joy is the simplest form of gratitude. May Yahweh grant your heart's desires and make all your plans succeed. Whoever this energy is, there's a lot of fucking spell work. Like, this energy sucks. It's just so ugh. We have here, delight yourself in Yahweh and he will give you the desire of your heart. Give thanks to Yahweh and proclaim his greatness. Let the world know what he has done. So I hope you all got a message from this read that will help you along your journey. Know that Yahweh loves you. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all later. Peace.